Everyone, welcome back to another episode of Valhalla. Thanks for tuning in. So we finally made rent. Don't even have to worry about that anymore. Um, today's the 30th, so I'm not sure when the game's gonna end. Let's not worry about that. I'm gonna go uh, take a look in the shop and see if we can purchase anything. I don't think we can af Oh, we can actually afford some things. Oh, we can actually afford some things. Okay, let's see. Um, uh, so I have about under 500. I want to buy just something for fun. Uh, movie poster. Oh yeah, she wanted this one time. She wanted this one time, but that's way too expensive. And uh, Mega Christmas has already passed, so you'd be one of those people if you had it at this point. Okay. Excuse me. Um, oh, okay, okay. I think I heard that you can actually play a video game, but uh, I can't afford it. If I wait a day, I could maybe afford it. Okay, oh, that's it. Mm, that's it. Then what's the last, like, drink we can order? Because I know there's one more slot. Okay, well, I'm just gonna spend money for funsies. There we go, bought it. Where is that in our room now? I can't tell. I think it's this one. I, can't, I think it's this one. There's too much crap. I want to change our wallpaper, too. God, let's go make some money. Let's go to work. <laughs> okay, here we go. Good evening. Uh, is he okay? Is he humming or is he thinking? Like, hmm, 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 or hmm, 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 hmm. Like, I can't tell. I can't tell. Gotta look. You gotta show me how to read your hmms, huh? Gil. Oh, oh, he's humming. Okay, thank you, Jill. I don't know the melody to Shine Spark, which is the, uh, one of the songs by Miki, right? Gil, are you humming Shine Spark? So, no, this doesn't have to do with Miki, right? It's unrelated, right? Uh. I uh, hi. <laughs> uh, hey, Jill. Are you okay? Are you in love, maybe? That's probably it, honestly. Hmm? <laughs> Nothing of the sort. I'm fine. Right. No, seriously. Did you, did you bang? Did you, did you have a fun time? Men only get so happy after they've banged. That's not... Oh my god, you totally banged! Was it Alma? Did you have seven minutes in heaven with her? No, I didn't. Stop. In any case, congratulations. There's there's a song for this. Lonely Island. Do if you guys know Lonely Island. Um, okay, uh, very uh, vulgar, but they were well known for like jizz in my pants and stuff like that back in the day. I think Dick in a Box. I don't know that one as well. Uh, the one that I the ones that I think are really funny are like where they they're on a like I'm on a boat and it's just, like a whole bunch of curse words and they try to do like a clean version for TV, but it just it was a, a disaster. But anyways. They have a song called, uh, I just had sex and it feels so good. And then they have like a cake in, in the music video that says congrats on the sex. That's what I thought of. So <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no, no. The number one, if you don't know Lonely Island, the only one you have to watch is, um, what the hell is it called? If you look up Pirates of the Caribbean, Lonely Island, it has Michael Bolton in it. That one, I just we could not stop singing. It was so funny. Anyways. Any, in any case, congrats on the sex. I haven't seen you this happy since, well, never. Oh, hey, she's ba- Wow. Wow, it has been a long time. It has been a long time. Okay, I just gave her like a random valley voice. Today's escapades will bring us to a familiar place and crap. Gil, uh, I'm out. <laughs> I'm just gonna go and duck out. See you later. Not so fast, flat bartender, if that's even your real name. Uh, <laughs> Last time my viewership had a weird peak while I was passed out. So I'm here to find out what made people so interested. Please get out. Please leave. <laughs> Please. Oh, oh, I think um, uh, Berkeley told me uh, something I could do while she's here. Can I type? Let me see. Uh, what was it? What was it? What was the trick? There's something I can do. There's, oh, oh. Oh, I got an achievement that has a little emoticon face, but I don't know if I actually typed anything. Ugh. It does does me typing cause that to happen? Oh, I'm gonna figure this out. Hello. I, am I doing that? I can't tell. Axis. Uh, buh, buh, buh. Okay, I think just every time I type, it creates a wall. I don't think I can actually custom type a message. <laughs> Enter. Did I do it? <laughs> Enter. I don't get it. What am I controlling? 
I don't know what I'm controlling. I, I feel like I'm doing that though. Whatever. Okay, whatever. I got an achievement for that. Let's move on. Huh? Hmm. -hmm. Do I have something on my face? This guy totally screwed. I guess girls just have this intuition. I don't know. <laughs> no doubt about it. That gleam in his eyes is unmistakable. Uh, I'm just I'm just gonna go and duck the hell out. Y'all just I'm gonna leave it to your own devices. Ugh, whatever. Just keep it down. Ah, uh, Jill, you're here. Isn't that the girl? Isn't that the passed out girl from two weeks ago? I'm not here. Oh, uh, sorry. I'll be back in my office then. What? 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 Why, why is she pretending not to be? I'm. What's going on? Anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and set this up. I'm gonna put my favorite song first. Um, where is it? All systems go, and then commencing simulation. There is one more achievement I could get right now, but I'd I'd rather not drive you guys crazy with that. One of them is apparently you can fill your entire playlist with the same song. Uh, I could do that. I could just do that real quick for fun, but I'll put like a pleasant song instead of one that might drive you crazy. Cause I do like all systems go, but I think uh, re-snowfall is like the most pleasant. The one that I'd be okay with just like constantly playing in the background, I probably won't notice. So, ready. <laughs> the achievement I got is I like it, okay? Time to mix drinks and change lives. Oh, hi, wait, so did streaming Chan leave? I thought she came here to find out what was going on? Is she gonna just silently observe? Probably not silently knowing her, but like, is she just gonna observe in the background and just watch us do work? Or like, how's this gonna work? I mean, if she's out of my hair, I don't really mind. Okay, hi Betty. Uh, hi Deal. What's going on with you two? Um, you are too happy and you are too mopey. What happened? I was right. Huh? That Laura girl was head over heels for him. I was right on the money. Oh no! Oh, Betty, I'm so sorry. And like, Deal doesn't even seem to be remotely interested in her, so. Oh, that sucks. Um, say, that girl. I'm not here! Uh, sorry. Isn't she the one that passed out last time? I guess that's just what she's known for, and everyone's gonna remember her for that forever. Anyways. Betty was right, and that deserves a beer. I'm gonna refer to myself. Betty will refer to herself in the third person. And you? I'm fine. A Friday beer for a cheerful Betty. Is she actually cheerful or is she being sarcastic? I don't really get what's going on. Okay, well, I'm gonna serve everybody big drinks still because uh, Mama wanna make some last minute money before the game ends of guess some new video games. Know what I'm saying? Well, oopsie, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, and yeah, mixed, here you go. For, uh, I was gonna say it in Betty's voice. For the occasion. All right, so, so she's, is she actually happy or is she upset? I'm confused. Is he, she's happy and he's mopey? Is that what Jill was saying? So the girl was actually infatuated with him? You should have seen her screaming from the top of her lungs that she liked him. Oh, did she try to do that when no one was looking but she got caught? Why did she do that? <laughs> and him just standing there thinking. Okay, she seems like the type of girl, cause they've, they've painted her to be a very ditzy, kind of frantic sort of girl. So I can totally see that happening and her being completely unaware of him being right there. Just like that. In retrospect, it was a tad too cliched for my taste. Ugh. Yeah, exactly, it, was, it sounds very cliched. Still, I knew she liked him. I was right, I was right. He doesn't seem particularly happy. Okay, okay clarified who's experiencing what. Oh my God, it's already looping. It's already driving me crazy. Oh no, I can't, I can't switch to another song. I've sealed my fate. I'm so sorry, you guys. He never is. Unlike your coworker. Holy crap, did he bang? Oh my God, everybody knows. Everybody knows. And you know, the, the irony of the situation, I think, is that I'm pretty sure he didn't. I'm pretty sure he didn't and everyone just thinks he did, but maybe he did, maybe he did, who knows? You're making it too obvious, Gil. How? That beaming face is unmistakable. The face of a guy that got some and enjoyed every moment. I, w I, want, I want the irony to be that he didn't. I mean, I guess, would that be too straightforward? I don't know. Back to Deal, though. Like I said, he seems lost in thought. Victories like these are few and far between. Let me enjoy myself. Oh, can I get something non-alcoholic? I lost my accent. <laughs> non-alcoholic here. That's not how you drown your sorrows, piece of scrap. I'll have a bloom light. Okay. 
Oh, thank God. Thank God she's not distracted because I completely forgot his order. Um, it's Bloom Light and something non-alcoholic. Okay. Bloom Light. Here we go. I wonder how he's feeling. I don't know. Um, we've kind of just seen him to be like a just a normal guy. I, I don't know if he's interested in this person. It doesn't seem like he is. All aged on the rocks and mixed. There we go. And then next is non-alcoholic. So it can be anything uh, that doesn't have alcohol. Okay, I, I've forgotten already, sorry. So just stuff that doesn't have carmatrine. Uh, okay, Bleeding Jane. Well, this is optional. Uh, I don't know. Crevice Spike. Let's just give him anything. I, I don't I don't know if I want to waste time trying to look for something that'll give me money. Uh, so just something that doesn't have karma train. Uh, something that sounds kind of nice. Let's just do that. Uh, um, I've got this, you guys. I've totally got this. Uh, who cares? This one's easy to make. Let us just do that. Optional karma train, aged, mixed. That should be good. Here. Thanks. Same. Celebrate all you want, but I'm freaking out here! I know nothing about relationships! I have no idea what to do! Well, for starters... What do you think, Jill? I'm going to completely not listen to this person because she's a chaotic disaster, have you as you've seen. Me? Her? Betty, I've seen a few of your relationships, remember? Aside from Veronica, there's Angela, Pamela, Sandra, a little bit of Rita in my life, a little bit of Monica by my side, and then, then, then Tina, all I need. Is this a reference to that song? Because I feel like I'm going to go look that up. I'm going to go look it up because it sounds like names from that list. Mambo number five. Y'all know Mambo number five, right? Lyrics. Okay. Yeah, it's totally. Oh my God, you guys. This is a reference to Mambo number five. Let me just read it. I like Angela, Pamela, Sandra, and Rita. And then as, as it goes on, a little bit of Monica, a little bit of Erica, a little bit of Rita, a little bit of Tina, a little bit of Sandra, a little bit of Mary, Jessica. And that's, I think that's all of them. I'm going to kill this game. <laughs> I'm going to stab it <laughs> with love. <laughs> all these names from Mambo number five. Or should I say... Didn't share the bed sheets. Snores like a pig. Cold feet. Shampoo water. Chocolate addict. Okay, so everything that she's had to say about her past relationships. Too religious. Fan of the wrong rugby team. T Tito Taylor. Like Tattle Taylor. Tito Taylor. And shoes with the mouth open. Ugh. What do you think, Jill? Okay, he got me there. Okay, I want to hear your opinion. God. That you must be quite the heartbreaker to have so many relationships in a short period of time. I mean, about piece of scrap situation, not mine. And thank you. I'm not the right person for this. Um, Gil? <laughs> Singing a random tune that I don't know. He's still on goddamn Cloud Nine. Or is it. Is it. <laughs> or is it banging in Cloud Nine? This doesn't work as well when I replace the words, but y'all get what I mean. What about Snakey Snakey? I'll be damned, she actually hides pretty well. Ugh. For starters, how do you feel about her? I don't know. I don't know her all that well. You could start there. Ask her out sometime, get to know her. Maybe she'll change her mind, maybe you'll change yours. In the end, you lose nothing by... Uh, what? I'm just realizing I'm just realizing I'm giving love advice to a Lilum. So I don't know how well it applies to you. Eh, these things are humans and all but organs nowadays anyways. If even if that's the case, it's interesting that she felt that way towards him. Why wouldn't she? This spell is a good catch if I do say so myself. And I and like I said, humans and all but organs. You're, you've surely encountered Lilum that you sometimes forget are not humans. Yeah, all the time in this game, all the time. Well, we live in weird times, but hey, that only makes them more interesting. It's odd going to other cities and not seeing the same integration of Lilum, though. Oh, that's specifically here, huh? Well, Glitch City is pretty much the cradle of social experiments involving Lilum integration, so... <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> just try to get to know her. You'll find out how you feel afterwards. Yeah, uh, I think I'll try that. It's quite the uninspired advice if you ask me. Anything else? 
Let's commemorate the occasion with a piano man and a piano woman. Now I need to serve a piano man and a piano woman. Okay, de deal. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah, you you don't know her. That's that's the whole issue here. So, go ahead, get to know her better, learn about love, about life, about humanity, as as a lilum, as you do on the rocks mixed. Uh, and it's already huge, so I do not need to make that any bigger than it already is. Okay, next. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three. Each mix. And I just wanted to check real quick the difference. What's the difference? Two, three, five, five, two, three, five, five, three, five, five, two, three, three. What's, what, what is that a reference to something? Obviously not like, I'm trying to think of like, I don't know, DNA or it's just something. What is, is that a reference to something? Who knows? Let's serve it. Here. And now we reach a stalemate. I'd normally take the piano man, but I feel there's a symbolic value in taking the woman. Hmm. Why order like that then? Hmm. Oh, 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 is she drunk? Is she? Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a completely new sprite. Have we even. We've seen Streaming Chan drunk. I don't think I've gotten anyone else drunk at this point. And, like, I didn't serve her an especially big drink. It's already big. Maybe she doesn't normally order big drinks? Hmm. Uh, anyways, let's keep going. Oh no! Is she drunk and emotional now? Oh my god! Uh, I hate Laura. Oh no! Oh no, sweetie! You, you what? She's gonna take you away from me. Oh! I'm con I'm so confused. Okay, obviously they're they're really really good friends. So I guess she's just there's a lot of complicated things going on because she had a crush on Laura, but she's happy to to have the victory of like I knew she liked you and like now she's nervous about them actually getting together in case he goes away. Oh, Betty, you're my piece of scrap, not hers. You're mine, mine. Betty, you don't own me. Besides, I can't for the life of me leave you alone. I feel like the moment I let you out of my sight, you'll just crash. <laughs> That's not a laughing matter. You need someone making sure you aren't kicking people. That's not normal, you know. Besides, it's not like I have something with her yet. You're right. So you won't leave me? Oh. I'd worry myself sick if I left you to your own devices, honestly. We should leave now. Oh, yeah. We're holding a small New Year's party tomorrow. I don't know if you want to come. We'll come. Are you sure? We will. Fine. We'll be here, Jill. Anyway, see you then. Bye, Bill. Please come again. Party? I'd love to go. Oh, no. No, I didn't want to invite her. I didn't want this. No. Why did she have to be here while we were asking someone we actually cared about? No. <laughs> you guys, this is terrible. I'm going to make text fly across the screen. How do I do it? What do I press? Oops, oops. I pressed space bar and it made the, the text advance. I, like, see, am I controlling that? I can't tell. Do I have to type a lot for that to happen? Okay, I'm running my hands across the keyboard right now. It, it's There's a lot happening. But I don't know if I'm, I think I'm doing that. I think I'm doing that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause usually they only do that if they're really excited about something. So I think I'm prompting that, but okay, whatever. <laughs> but I told everyone that tomorrow I'd end the party, the year with a party myself. So sorry. Yeah, no, you're not invited. Who cares? Leave. Uh, I totally forgot she was already here. Man, that was such bliss. Still, I can see how traffic spiked. Things can get fun here. And just like the last time, I need to show my viewers something fun. Give me something nasty. Ugh, something... Ugh, she wants something nasty again. Okay, okay. Um, promo was stuff that was pretty disgusting. So, promo. And uh, I'm going to pick the most expensive because I don't like you. Let's see. A piano woman and man are, I think, the most expensive drinks on the menu. So, we're going to give you... Uh, I, I don't know. Sour promo strong. I'm just gonna like, what would I definitely hate getting? Sweet promo happy. Sour promo strong sounds terrible. So let's do that. Um, here we go. One, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, all on the rocks and mixed. Here you go. Here. 
This has the... <clears throat> Hold on. <clears throat> it was nasty, all right. And now it's time for me to be a nice person and give you something nice. Huh? It's the second time I'm here, so it's only natural you get your own copy of my theme song. Oh, did we unlock a track? I'm actually... What's your theme song sound like? Can we play it right now? No, thank you. Don't be shy. Let me give you one. I mean it. No, thank you. Well, too late. It's already in your player. <laughs> that can't... How in the ever-living hell did you do it? Magic. That's bull crap. Video editing magic. Did you just hack into the music player? Oh my God, are you part of Alice Rabbit? Is there just everybody I've met so far is all part of Alice Rabbit and you're all hiding it from me? Let's move on, shall we? Okay, that's really, that's actually really suspicious. Are you a hacker? Are you, are you a hacker? Are you also, is everyone not who they appear to be? Do you also have some kind of secret serious persona? I kind of doubt it with this person, but like, She's got she's a hacker that that's what they're hinting at. That's why there's this whole moment here It can't be a meaningless moment, right? Anyways, let's keep talking to streaming Chan in the next episode I will see you then Zaxxus over and out